Hey, welcome to this Windows 10 channel. Today we're going to uh, actually show you uh, two tips and tricks in one. Um, it's for the file explorer. Um, how to view the hidden files and folders in Windows and also how to view file extensions. It's very easy in Windows 10 and Windows 8 to do that um, and I believe it started in Windows 7 where you had this little check mark that you can just put in the file explorer to have a view of hidden files and folders. Now the reason why you might want to see those, um, especially if you're you know, someone that is the kind of the tech guy of the family, is because of a lot of times some of the malware and viruses will be hidden in these folders that you cannot see normally and uh, it could be just you know you need to fix something you need to access a folder that exists on the computer but is invisible the reason why they are invisible is because most of these are not meant for you to actually go and play with them because they are important for windows 10 and windows in general um, to work well so to view hidden files and folders all you do is go into your file explorer if you don't have it in your taskbar like I do you can go into the search or Cortana and just type file explorer and you'll see at the top file explorer desktop app now as you see here I have the ribbon here at the top so you need to have that to view it so if you don't have the ribbon at the top there's this little down arrow customize quick access you need to remove the check mark in front of minimize the ribbon because by default uh, most of you are probably in this view which is not the one that I want so you'll click that little down arrow remove the check mark and minimize and you'll see that there's a ribbon go into the view tab at the top and you'll see that hidden files or hidden items is here you just put a check mark and it's gonna show you and I'm gonna give you an example let's go to the C drive look at the folders that I have here now let's put hidden items notice that I've got other folders now that are um, not as bright as the others because it's a way of Windows of telling you well this is usually a hidden folder so you should not see it so uh, that's where you go to view these um, hidden files and folders file extensions a lot of people uh, like to have file extensions you know if you're you've been using Windows for a long time file extensions is something that we often looked at when uh, we were in Windows you know XP or in earlier versions of Windows very long time ago um, and because for a lot of people the icons don't mean nothing but knowing that it's a doc file they know it's a word file uh, knowing that a PDF is you know a document a type of uh, portable document file um, and so on and uh, you know viewing mp3 they know that it's a song or it's some audio and so on but by default Windows does not show file name extensions so let's give an example let's go to my documents folder here and you see I've got something here which is a PDF it does say you know and that's why Microsoft changed this because what they wanted to do basically is well we're not gonna put the extension but we're gonna say what type of file it is uh, but you can actually go and just put that little check mark here and file name extensions and you'll see that now all the files have the extension so now you see August 2015 dot PDF if I had some uh, um, documents made by word you would see doc X for the more recent and doc for others uh, look here when I go to my download folder you can see here now you see dot exe for the executable files you see that the windows that ISO for the image file for Windows 10 exists here so uh, that's the interesting part of putting the file name extensions some people prefer to view the file name extensions when they go through their documents rather than uh, icons so this is how you do it so hidden files or hidden items and file name extensions two tips and tricks in this video I hope you enjoy them 
If you enjoy my videos, why not subscribe to my channel? You'll be informed when new videos are online. If you have any comments, questions, anything you want to know about Windows 10 or any version of Windows, I can look it up and try to help you if possible. Um, if you subscribe, well, you'll know when new videos are online. And typically we try to post, you know, as many videos as we can every day to help you uh, learn more about Windows 10. And hopefully you enjoy my videos and we'll check them out. Thank you for watching.